This is Aurora Central Football. 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 And today, this is Aurora Central Football. With 10 total wins in the past seven years and no playoff appearances for nearly 24 years, success has not come easy at Aurora Central. But this fall, the Trojans brought in head coach Travis Peoples. And with the new head coach came new expectations. And the results have been sterling. Every single person I ever talked to, including the guys uh, where I was coaching, including that coming in this building, there's people in this building. When I first walked in, they said, you, you know you can't win here. Um, you know, to me, I just thought it was kids that were hungry, kids that were hard working, they were looking for someone to point them in the right direction. Coach Peoples, when I first met him, he comes in, and the first thing that I noticed about him is he already knew us. He, he had watched us before, and he had a plan for us, a plan of action. And to come into a new job that quickly and with a purpose, it kind of surprised us as players. And if we were, they, he was excited to see us and excited to you know, coach us, and that, it was a new thing for us. So. There you go. Go. He has a great passion for, a get, for the game. He just loves it. He loves, cares about us. He makes us work and grind every day, make sure we're doing good in school. He's a real caring person. As he told us when he first came in, it was going to be a lot, a lot. We were going to play a lot physical, you know, having a new, a new scheme and everything. And so, you know, I think kind of what people expected was more wins, but they didn't expect us to go very far. Couldn't be a better school to work at. You know, the things that I heard about the school and, and driving out here that you can't win, I, I found the opposite to be true. Great kids, kids that are really hardworking, kids that are hungry for success in the classroom, kids that are hungry for success on the football field, and kids that want to be something in life. And it's great to be here. It's kind of refreshing when you have kids that, that are that hungry. They haven't been there. They haven't been to the top of the mountain, so I think it makes us even hungrier. It's just amazing watching the change because the past couple of years, there's been a lot of wasted opportunities. And just people just don't take the chances. And Coach Peoples came in and it's just been changing. Everybody's been taking these opportunities. They've been changing themselves and the whole aspect around them, the whole atmosphere has been changing. And there is one word that embodies this year's Trojan squad, family. I'll play for any one of these dudes any day of the week. I'll, I'll go to war with them any day. You know, I just, I just love this team. It's a, it's a family atmosphere. It's no me on this team. We all do it for each other. Strength of this team, like I said, it's a family. We work together, we grind together. Um, we joke together, they kind of, we keep practices funny and, you know, but at the same time serious. And that kind of just makes us a family and makes the game roll a lot better. Aurora Central sits at 7-0 with three games to go in the regular season. They have the attention of us here at XSR. But do they have the attention, and more importantly, the respect of the rest of the state? I don't know if they do or not. It doesn't really matter. We believe in ourselves. That's all that matters. I think they're definitely still asleep on us, but it's okay. We're just going to keep working and, and just shock the state. Go to the state championship. That's our goal. I, I don't speak for the rest of the state, but at the end of the season, I guarantee that we will make a statement and we will, they will see the change. And I'm not a big guy to look at uh, statistics and look at uh, rankings, but I'm seeing that uh, some of these uh, uh, outlets have us ranked as 50-point underdogs against uh, um, Wheat Ridge and Denver South, and we kind of feed off that. I mean, we may be. Maybe we're not that good. Maybe we are. Um, we feel like in our building that we got a shot every week if we come and prepare for that guy um, and play hard and, and do the things we need to do. Most people didn't believe in us at first, but, you know, after a while, you know, kind of have a spotlight on us now. So it's been a really good ride. 